All right, Ivan Putski going up against Saito and uh, Salvatore and Ivan Kolov moving back outside of the ring. There's the bell. They lock up collar and elbow, and uh, Putski has this phenomenal strength, Don, that we've seen uh, for the past several weeks. I'll tell you, he's rugged. Uh, I'm the guy that broke that block over his head, and, and uh, I was terrified of breaking his neck, and, and it didn't bother him at all. But his entire body is like that. It's great power and, and, and endurance, and the tremendous ability to take punishment without appearing to notice it. Remarkable man. There again, bringing Saito away, but Saito not relinquishing that uh, front face lock, and so Putski. Those are two tremendous lifts that he's just performed. That's a big, heavy man, Saito, and he's to lift him under those conditions. He's not able to get him up to get him over, but he's certainly getting him up off the, the mat, and that, that's three times that he's lifted all of that weight. All the time, as you can observe there, Gordon, he's, he's, he's not able to breathe properly. He's got that face lock on him. And although it's a legal face lock, it still is uh, constricting his breathing a little bit. No question. He finally pulls it back. Anyway, Saito catching him with a chop. Coming off ropes, catching him with another chop. And this is what Saito's been looking for. That opening, and Putski fires back. And now you've got a slip fest between these two now. Open-handed chops to the throat. Now Putski continues to close in. Putski whips him off the ropes. Caught him with that holy sledgehammer. Saito staggered back. Putski brings him up, full body slam, and down for that pin. Wait a minute, Kolov! Kolov has come off that top rope! Kolov has come off the top rope. And the referee calling for the bell and disqualifying. Putski, however, he's, Saito is disqualified for interference, but look at this Putski. Putski took that right in the front of the back and is on his feet. Saito, who was underneath him, really had it driven out of him. Putski is the winner. And now Putski, Putski coming out to the ring apron after Ivan Kolov. Putski, and Don, hit that man took 250 some odd pounds right squarely in the middle of his back. That, that obviously hurt Saito more than it, uh, than it did Putski. That's remarkable, that tremendous impact. It, it can crash him through and hurt Saito. And yet Putski's still ready to fight and seemed only to have uh, been aware of something happened, but it doesn't seem to be bothering him too much. And Kolov now, there you can see him at the bottom of the screen. Putski's inviting him in the ring. Putski inviting him into the ring. And it looks like Putski's going to get into that ring. It looks like we're completely out of time and it's, they're, they're after each other, but I don't, we'll be, we're gone.